we have a new identity now, we've merged into one tribe, but the fact of the matter remains that we're still divided into two tribes, and as Aitutaki came in with fewer numbers, things look pretty bleak. Rero. They want to vote for Yule right now. They think he's the mastermind. Yule is the choice because he's brilliant. He's like Mr. Harvard, Yale, Stanford guy. And he's also really, really strong. So we just want to get him out as quickly as possible. You don't want Yule for the challenges. Okay. I mean, I agree. I just it's intelligent. I do not want that boy thinking anymore. You know what I'm saying? You don't want that clock ticking there, homie. You know, I don't really have an option here. I got to figure out something that's going to work. and. This might work. We've kind of come up with a desperate plan based on the fact that I have the hidden immunity idol and it could change, hopefully, the whole flow of the game. I'm asking you for both of our sakes to become my ally again. This is the only chance we got. Everyone recognizes that. This is the only way this is gonna work. I thought about it though. I would wanna go to the final two with you because honestly, I think my chance against you are better than either Becky or Sandra because they haven't made many enemies, right? You have made enemies. You all. So if that's the case, then I too is down in numbers. The likelihood that all four of us are here at all is very low, but we stuck together and prevailed against the odds. But the fact remains, you know, both tribes are tight. And so we came in at a huge disadvantage and the odds are still stacked against us. So I don't know what our fate is gonna be. I feel like tonight's gonna be pivotal. Tonight, they will decide who they think is most deserving of the title of sole survivor and the million dollars that goes along with it. Yule. Opening statement. I honestly feel that I've probably done more than anyone else to really affect and influence the overall course of this game. I won't lie about the fact that I've had to manipulate and deceive people, but I've stayed loyal to people who are loyal to me. So I would love to get your vote tonight, and I feel like I've earned my way here. I have played every facet of the game, and in a way that you know I'm proud of. One of the main reasons I wanted to even be on Survivor was the fact that minorities were underrepresented on media. Like when I grew up, I didn't see people look like me on TV. And whenever you see a lot of minorities on TV, it's just kind of caricatures. I wanted America to see Asian American men as they truly are. And if I do win this game, you know, I, I'd want to be a very visible spokesperson for talking about how we can move forward and try to get more minorities represented on TV. The winner of Survivor Cook Islands.